Posters welcoming Prime Minister Narendra Modi dot the streets of Srinagar as he heads to the state with a pre-Diwali gift. Security arrangements for the rally that Prime Minister will address in Srinagar are in place. In Baglihar, PM will commission and dedicate for 50 megawatt power project to the nation besides laying the foundation stone for four laning of Udhampur Banihal National Highway stretch. The Baglihar project has been conceived on River Chenab with a generation capacity of 900 megawatt to be developed in two stages of 450 megawatt each. Power generation under the first phase has begun and the Prime Minister will inaugurate phase two of the project. The second phase comprises of three units with a generating capacity of 150 megawatts. Cost of the entire project is rupees 3,100 crores. This project promises to end the power woes of the people of Jammu and Kashmir. Our agent has stated that we have a hydropower deficit. So, this is a commissioning. We will have a lot of deficit. On the other side, Prime Minister Narendra Modi will also be laying the foundation stone uh, for the highway project between Udhampur and Banihal. Well, this is a four laning highway project, and the cabinet has already approved uh, 3186 crore rupees for the widening of this uh, highway project. Now, this uh, highway project has almost seven tunnels, which will, which will reduce the, uh, the uh, travel time between Udhampur and Banihal. Also, this highway project will play an important role as far as connectivity is concerned because we've already heard about the highways being closed during time of landslides or during the time of heavy rainfall but because of these uh, tunnels and the widening of the highway projects uh, this this problem will not be faced by the tourists and the local people prime minister narendra modi spent his diwali last year in srinagar after devastating floods hit the valley on saturday he heads once again for the state this time with precious gifts for the people of jammu and kashmir i just wish to appeal to the people of the state to come forward listen to the prime minister who is committed to the equitable development of all the three regions of Kashmir, Jammu and Ladakh and to make Jammu and Kashmir, including the Kashmir Valley, a part of the holistic development plan that this present government envisages for the state. It is hoped that the people of the state will reciprocate the Prime Minister's commitment and sentiments towards this region. Anuj Yadav in Srinagar and Arun Sharma in Baglihar reporting for DD News.